In this presentation, we will understand how to change list items in Python. So without any further delay, let's get started. The first topic of this presentation is changing an item. The second topic is changing multiple items. And the third topic is inserting a new item. Let's first understand how to change an item of a list. We can change an item of a list by referring to the index of that specific item which we want to replace. For example, let's open our command prompt and let's activate the Python interactive shell. After activating the Python interactive shell, let's type this command. List equal to Rob, Jennifer, 1, 2 and Bob. Let's say that we have this list with a total of 5 items. Now let's say that we want to replace this item by some other item. Let's say we want to replace this integer by a string. We can do that easily by referring to the index of this item which is 2. Because this item is at third position in this list. So the index of this item is 2. Now let's hit enter and type this command. List 2 equal to Michael. By referring to the index of this item, we can replace this item by this string Michael. Let's hit enter and let's check whether our list is updated. For this, we will type list and then we will hit enter. We will get Rob, Jennifer, Michael, 2 and Bob as the result. We can easily observe that this item has been replaced by this string Michael. So, I hope with this it is clear how to change an item of a list. Now, let's move on to the next topic that is changing multiple items. It is possible to change multiple items by using the slicing operator. So, we need to pass a range of values in this case. So, in place of passing a single value, which means in place of passing a single index, we can pass a range of indices. For example, let's open our command prompt again and let's consider the same example list where we have a total of 5 items. This time, let's say the requirement is to replace these two items by a total of 3 different items. For this purpose, let's type this command list 2 colon 4 equal to Michael, Anderson and Emma. We want to replace these two items by these three items. For this, we must pass 2 colon 4 here because the index of this item is 2 and index of this item is 3. We must pass 2 colon 4 here, which means we are referring the items from index number 2 to index number 3. It is always last index minus 1. So we are referring items from index number 2 to index number 3. This means we are referring these two items and we want to replace these two items by these three strings. Let's hit enter now. As we are not getting any error, this means we have successfully replaced these two items by these three items. Let's check this by typing list and let's hit enter. We will get this list Rob, Jennifer, Michael, Anderson, Emma and Bob. These two items are successfully replaced by these three items. Let's consider one more example where we will pass less items to this list. This time we will type list 2 colon 4 equal to Michael. This time we want to replace these two items by just one item, this string Michael. Let's hit enter. And now let's type list to check whether the list is updated or not. Let's hit enter again. We will get this list Rob, Jennifer, Michael and Bob. We are getting the correct list. The list is updated. These two items are replaced by the single item Michael. So I hope with this it is clear how to change multiple items of a list. We can use the slicing operator to replace multiple items. Now with this, we are done with this topic and this means now we are ready to understand the next topic which is inserting a new item. Let's now understand how to insert a new item in a list. 
we can do that by using the insert method the insert method can be used to insert a new item in the list we can follow the syntax of the insert method first we need to provide the list where we want to insert a new item then dot then insert and within parentheses we must provide the index and the item index refers to the position where we want to insert the item and item refers to the item which we want to insert now let's understand how this insert method works for this we will open our command prompt and again we will consider the same example list with five items now let's say we want to insert a new name let's say it is mike at the third position of this list for this we can type this command list dot insert two comma mike as we want to insert this item at the third position we must specify two here let's hit enter and type list to check whether the list is updated let's hit enter again we will get this list rob jennifer mike one two and bob this item is successfully inserted at position three the rest of the items are moved forward so we are done with this topic also we have learned how to insert a new item in the list with this we are done with all the topics of this presentation we have understood how to change an item of a list we have learned how to change multiple items and we have also learned how to insert a new item in a list okay friends this is it for now thank you for watching this presentation i will see you in the next one